and my name's Phil. Today I'm going to take you through setting up of uh, dialysis. Um, this will be my 695th time that I've been on dialysis, so I do know it back to front by now. I've been doing it for nearly six years, and uh, I'll start now. So, first, so firstly we'll start turning it on, turn the machine on, and the water, this is a water filter at the top here, uh, basically the, the water gets filtered through two, two filters, a charcoal filter and a membrane filter. So by the time the water gets to mix with your blood, it's uh, fairly clean. Uh, also, what mixes with the water is um, a dialysate, what they call a dialysate. Uh, the dialysate has a mixture of calcium and various elements in it uh, to mix with the water so that, uh, um, I'm not really sure, but it mixes with your blood as well so to keep all your chemicals in your blood correct. <coughs> Now what, what the machine is going through now is just an initial uh, checkup and uh, it's checking its systems. Everything's come up okay. So now I'll put it through a rinse system. What that does is rinse all the internal uh, tubes and various things inside the machine. Um, and that takes 16 minutes. So what, during that 16 minute time, I'll start setting up. Firstly, we've got the kidney. Kidney uh, in there. And these are the tubes. Just there for the machine. Two bags of sailing, which hang up on the hook. Everything is sealed. And uh, I've washed my hands nice and clean before I started all this process. So you don't contaminate anything. And I've had the seals off the end of the saline bags. Okay. Don't touch the end of those. Now, while that is happening. <coughs> What you have is a, a tourniquet. A tourniquet. Just put that on my arm. Now I use two points on my arm. Uh, down here, as you can see, all my veins have fairly swollen up over the years. Um, they do attach uh, two veins inside your arm to increase the flow in this vein, which makes it get larger. As time goes by. Now I use two points I use down here uh, for the blood to come out and I use up here for the blood to go back in. That gives a good distance apart. Uh, a lot of people use down both out and in down the bottom here um, but I feel that um, the blood going back in could be redrawn back through the machine and I, I feel you get a better amount of blood with, it, with those two points a good distance apart. You get more blood goes through the machine, so thereby you get better cleaning. Now I'll just unpack this pack. Now all these go on the machine. This attaches to close the seal. This attaches to the saline, to a saline bag. I'll just prime that, I'll just open this valve and that'll fill it up with saline. Let's see it coming out the bottom. Close it off and leave that up there. Okay, now this is the first arterial line. Let's rest all that 
behind me. What I'm putting, what I'm doing now is putting the pump section of the line in into the pump. Now, I'll spin this, that'll feed it around. Close it up. That actually pumps the fluids. Keeps your blood flowing, pumps the blood from your body through to the whole system. This is a bubble trap here, in case you get any air in the line. Now attach one end to the inlet of the kidney. kidney back to your body. Just get all these 